So here in this video we will showcase the 15 upcoming movies and TV shows with monsters and creatures that are slated to be released between August and December this year. These will include horror flicks, sci-fi and fantasy as well. So strap yourselves for a fun 5 months of creature features. Let's get to it. Number 1 Borderlands Releasing August 9th Based on a well acclaimed game with pretty low ratings which shall be deliberated by other more critical reviewers, the adaptation has just been released and for many of you I think, it's still upcoming as you would see it in the coming days. It follows a bunch of misfits and bounty hunters that aim to uncover the secrets of the vaults of a planet called Pandora. In the movie, there will be gigantic alien monsters and also pretty nasty bandits. Number 2 Alien Romulus Releasing 16th of August The most recent addition to the Alien franchise, here in this movie we will again catch up with the dreaded xenomorphs and will return back to a claustrophobic cosmic horror setting where a bunch of people would hack into an abandoned space station called the Romulus to steal valuable technology, only to encounter the most dangerous life form in the galaxy awaiting new unwitting hosts to feed and to propagate. Number 3 Consume Also releasing August the 16th This movie is a horror flick that follows a married couple, Jay and Beth, taking a celebratory camping trip a year after Beth's cancer remission, but them instead finding themselves trapped between a wild man and a skin stealing monster. I must confess we know little of the movie, but we expect it to give us a terrifying creature for entertainment. Number 4 Hellhole Releasing August 23rd Here in this also not so well marketed movie, we will follow an American led oil fracking team in the middle of the wilderness of the country of Serbia. When they start drilling, fracking, they will come into contact with a dormant parasitic monster that is trapped and inactive deep within a frozen rock complex. When released, all hell will break loose. Number 5 The Rings of Power Yeah, we still have this show running even after all the inaccuracies of the first season, like a short bratty Galadriel and a boy band hairstyle elf. Anyway, picking up from where they left off, Sauron has been identified and they would still begin creating the rings of power, god knows why. But, but, they will definitely give us a treat with awesome gigantic monsters like the Sea Worm, the Balrog and even Shelob. Number 6 Beetlejuice Beetlejuice September 6th, a long awaited sequel to the first movie of 1988, Beetlejuice Beetlejuice returns to the Deeds home of Winter River after a sudden death of a character, a beloved one, called Charles Deeds. When someone says Beetlejuice's name three times, the mischievous demon gleefully returns to unleash his very own brand of mayhem. Expect to see a few monsters here with the chaos created by the mischievous demon. Number 7 Transformers 1 September 20th This animated prequel rather than being set on Earth will instead focus on the origins of Optimus Prime and Megatron and is set on Cybertron before the great war between the Autobots and the Decepticons. Expect to see the classic Cybertron and Transformers possibly in their early forms before they came to Earth as well as new villainous beings known as the Quintessons. Number 8 Hellboy the Crooked Man The fan favorite son of Hell, Hellboy, here will face off against a malevolent figure known as the Crooked Man who is a character deeply rooted in the mountainous Appalachian folklore. The movie is likely to feature various demonic entities and possibly undead creatures connected to the crooked man's cursed land. Number 9 Venom The Last Dance This sequel might explore new characters and continue the clash between Venom and other symbiotes like the new Toxin and Scream. But also the symbiote homeworld is en route to arrive on Earth probably fleeing from an even more horrific and dangerous species, ones which might even be predators of the already powerful Clintar race, the symbiotes, one which was shown in the trailer hinted to be known as a xenophage. Number 10 Star Wars The Skeleton Crew December 3rd Star Wars The Skeleton Crew is an upcoming American science fiction television series directed and created by John Watts and Christopher Ford for the streaming service Disney+. Plus. This Star Wars spin-off focusing on a group of kids lost in the galaxy, would introduce new alien species and perhaps some dangerous creatures native to unexplored worlds. Given its Star Wars setting, expect a mix of familiar and new alien fauna. Number 11 Werewolves Releasing December the 6th 
Werewolves is an upcoming American horror thriller film directed and co-produced by Stephen C. Miller and written by Matthew Kennedy. It follows two scientists trying to stop a mutation that turns people into werewolves to lycanthropes after being touched by a supermoon the year before. After the recent movie called The Beast Within, starring Kit Harrington, Jon Snow, again him being a wolf, not the wolf of Winterfell, but a werewolf. This movie, The Werewolf, will be the second werewolf flick of the year 2024, but produced on a really constrained budget. Number 12. Lord of the Rings, The War of the Rohirrim, December the 13th. Produced by New Line Cinema and Warner Bros. Animation, the film will be a prequel to Peter Jackson's The Lord of the Rings film trilogy. It'll be an animated flick set in the world of Middle-earth, focusing on the history of Rohan, in particular rather than the elves or the hobbits. Of course, we can expect to see classic Tolkien creatures like the orcs, the walks, and possibly even trolls, and even more fantastical beings like the drakes or other ancient threats, and even good creatures like the ants. Number 13, Nosferatu, releasing December 25th. Ha! We're getting a vampire for Christmas. This is a remake of the 1922 film of the same name, Nosferatu, based on the Bram Stoker's novel. 1897 novel called Dracula, a reimagining of the classic vampire story. This film will focus on the iconic Nosferatu vampire, likely featuring dark gothic horror elements with eerie vampire lore and perhaps other nightmarish creatures of the night, and also a, some sort of a dark, twisted romance, a feeling between Dracula and a human lover. Number 14, The Tales from the Void. Tales from the Void is an episodic horror anthology series adapted from the most viral and haunting stories from the depths of the internet. A horror anthology that might explore various eldritch creatures from the void. Expect Lovecraftian inspired monsters, possibly including tentacled horrors, otherworldly entities, and mind bending abominations, or maybe just simple serial killers and paranormal hauntings. Its release date is still unknown, but it is expected to be here by the fall of 2024. And lastly, Dune Prophecy. Dune Prophecy is an upcoming American science fiction television series loosely based on Frank Herbert's works. Serving as a prequel to the 2021 film Dune, the series will dive into the origins of the Bene Gesserit, an influential and secretive sisterhood known for their superhuman abilities and their power behind the throne of the Emperor. Set around 10,000 years before the events of the film, after the Butlerian Jihad, it will explore the intense physical and mental training the Bene Gesserit have to undergo to harness their extraordinary powers and their prophecy of the upcoming Kwisatz Hedrach 10,000 years in the future. And so those are the 15 upcoming monster movies and TV shows from August to December this year. Yeah, of course, Dune Prophecy won't be in Arrakis and we won't be able to see the sandworms again, but they might dive into the origins of these creatures of the Shy Halert. Anyway, if you like this video, then watch this other one too. And do check out our channel for other dragon and monster content. We might have things we haven't seen before. Like, subscribe, and we'll see you in the next video. Take care, guys.